And we're back again. Uh, once again, just got off work, back to the hotel. Let's try this TV one more time. And you know what's sad? I've talked to, the, uh, I've been, I've been fighting with the front office over this TV for the last week. And they keep saying, oh, somebody's going to come and, you know, the guy's going to come, you know, maintenance going to come by and get you a new TV. Yeah. I've already threw $350 at him last week. And then to, to earlier today, I threw another 370 at him, 380 Again, no TV. Let's try this again. Power done. And... Wow, it doesn't look like the backlight even... Now the backlight just turned on. And no signal on HDMI 2. But we're going to fix that. Let's turn the PS2 on and see what happens. And it's not picking up my PS2, or PS5, rather. Yep, no signal. Let's try powering it off again. And the power button on the remote, dead. The buttons on the side of the panel, don't work. And now we got to unplug it again. And it's doing that flashing diagnostic code in the corner. Backlight, no signal. My PS5 is on. There should be video output. And the power doesn't work on the remote. Gotta unplug it again. And plug it back in. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, it flashes green three times. And still no signal. And the power button on the remote still does not work. Try this again. I should not have to go through this. When you throw $400 at a hotel, this shouldn't be happening. Ever. Especially not a week. And the backlight turned on and still no signal. And the remote and you know, still won't turn off. I just got to keep on unplugging it and plugging it back in until the thing decides to work, if it's going to. No signal. This is ridiculous. Still no signal. I, I don't know if I'm going to get this TV working or not. <laughs> what a joke. Power button still doesn't work. And I told them, I've been telling them for a week, eventually this TV will stop working. Okay, now, it didn't automatically turn on. It flashed the green code three times and then turned red. That means the power button will now work.
whether I got a signal or not. Yep, still no signal. But the power button now should work, and it should turn it off, which it did. So now the power button turned it off. Now I can turn it back on. This tells me that the problem is the inverter. And the only way to fix that would be to order one. This is an old TV, so you have to order a new inverter off eBay and do a swap. And it's not even worth it. It's not even worth the price of the inverter or the labor it takes to do it. Once again, no signal. Turn it on. Turn it back off. <sighs> this is insanity. It takes six freaking min minutes to get a TV to work in this damn hotel. There's no reason for it not to get re a signal unless the, the you know that PS5 is running. It's sitting there doing nothing. And now the remote power button stopped working. No, now it works. All right, I'm gonna. I think it's the batteries. This is ridiculous. Right there. Oh, see, look at that. No. Nah. Yep. Boom. <laughs> I wanted to catch that on camera. There we go. Now it. We should see how it went dark. And then it came back in. Yep, the inverter's fucked. And I have no sound. So that means now if I turn it on and turn it back off, it'll work. It'll give me video and sound. I should not have to go through a seven minute rigmarole after throwing 300 almost $400 at a freaking goddamn hotel. I should not be going through this. Especially not for a week. Yep, now I got sound. So now the TV will work until I go to work tomorrow. At 3 o'clock, at 2 o'clock or whenever I turn this son of a bitch off, it won't work again. You know what, I'm going to put this on YouTube. Maybe uh, maybe shaming them into a, 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 shaming these people into a, action might work. Because we know they won't listen to money. Trust me, they got over $800 out of me in the last two weeks, and I'm still going through this. <laughs> so, you, you know the money ain't talking. Oh, he's just so busy. No, nobody's this busy. Nobody is this busy to find another TV from a room without an occupant and do a switch. And then replace the darn TV or something. No. This is, a, this is a deliberate decision. These are deliberate decisions by management. And this is their priority. This kind of customer service is their priority. It's the prevention of customer service. That's what this is. They prevent it from happening. <sighs>